So first of all, I'm going to use a Mary Kay eye primer. And I'm just putting this all over the eye area, so basically from my eyelid and up to my brow bone. You can put it underneath your eye, but I totally forgot about that. Now I'm getting this really bright red colour. Now it may look orange in video, but it is a really bright red. And I'm just putting that from my lash line upwards above my crease, pretty much. And I'm making like a circular shape as well. And I'm bringing that into the edge of my eyelid. And always look forward to, because this will make it much more easier for you to shape. And I'm bringing that down to my tear duct. Just add colour until you're happy with the vibrancy. And now I'm just going to blend that out. So blending upwards. And this is a good time to shape it out too. So I want to shape it out into a more rounded shape. Now I'm getting this really bright blue colour and I'm just putting this on my lid so nowhere near the crease at all but you are going to blend it in with the red shadow that's on the edge of your lid. And also bring it towards the tear duct. So add colour as you go when you're happy with the vibrancy. Now I'm getting this really dark red eyeliner and I'm just bringing it to the middle of my lash line and I'm basically just tracing around the red eyeshadow. And I'm bringing it all the way down to the crease as well. Now I'm getting a matte black eyeshadow and I'm using an angled brush for this and all I'm doing is putting it over the dark red eyeliner. I just want this to be a really dark colour so I'm just blending it in so it's not black but it's kind of a dark purple colour. So you may need to blend a lot. Now I'm just adding more red because I felt like I lost some of the colour. Now I'm getting this goldish yellow colour with a concealer brush and I'm just bringing that all over my bottom lash line. Now I'm getting this shimmery white pigment and I'm using the same brush and all I'm doing is putting it over the gold that's in the tea duct. And I'm also dabbing some of that with my finger on my brow bone. Now I'm getting my blending brush again and I'm just blending that all out. This is just so the red has something to blend in with, and so it's just a good gradients. Now I'm getting a black eyeliner, and all I'm doing is I'm lining all of my eyes, so that means my bottom waterline, tight lining my top waterline, and bringing it all the way across my tear duct. Now I'm getting these really big eyelashes. I love these. Oh my god. And I'm just getting some eyelash glue and my tweezers to place them in the middle of my lash line. And then I'm using my fingers to place it in and make sure it's all stuck down. So make sure it's right on the lash line. So pretty. 
Now I'm getting my bow volumized in mascara. And all I'm doing with this is I'm just pushing my own lashes onto the fake eyelashes so they're all blended in. Now I'm getting my smooch black liquid eyeliner and I'm just lining over the eyelash bone so that it's all blended in and so it just looks like it's connected to my eyes. Just adding more blue here because I thought I lost some of the colour. Now I'm getting these nail art gems and I'm using yellow ones. I'm getting some tweezers and eyelash glue and I'm just placing it on the edge of my eye onto the red eyeshadow. And now we're done. So this I thought was really pretty. I thought the red and blue worked really well together. And yeah, it just reminded me of Wonder Woman. So that's it. And I hope you liked it. This is my first look for my eye lookbook. So see you guys. It's falling.